Happy February! Happy February, Scorpio! Yes, this is the uh, monthly reading for the sign of Scorpio for the month of February. And we have a lot of interesting things happening with the planet this month. And the first thing is, is that we have a new moon on the 1st. A new moon in the sign of Aquarius on the 1st. We have a full moon in the sign of Leo on the 16th. We have the Mercury retrograde going direct on the 4th. Yay, happy day. And we have Valentine's Day. So there's going to be a lot of things happening on Valentine's Day, and we're going to find out how that affects you. But let me just say this to you, Scorpio. Finding the truth is important for you this month. Finding the truth is important to you. With co-ruler Mars in your communication sector, you desire to get to the bottom of issues no matter what it takes. You want to know the truth. There is a relentlessness in your drive to gain the truth and to get clarity regarding certain matters. You want to know what's happening. You don't want to be left in the dark. So you are going to go after the truth. And with the new moon in your career sector, trying to figure out why you haven't reached your career goals can be a real issue for you. You want to know why I'm working so hard. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. Why haven't I reached certain uh, goals? And you want to know if someone is standing in the way of you achieving your success. So that's going to be something you're going to put in a lot of energy in. The full moon turns your focus on family matters and those matters that don't seem to get better. You know how there's a matter in your family that just keeps popping up, cropping up, and won't get any better? Where you are going to be prepared to approach a difficult family issue in hopes of putting it to rest. So good luck with that. On Valentine's Day, lots of eyes will be on you. So regardless of what you do, look good. Look good, Scorpio. Big attention will be given to you by someone special. But a question concerning love will come your way. So be prepared to answer it. Somebody may have a question for you. Okay? So for this month's reading, I'm going to add the messages from the tarot. I have three decks. So let's see what the first tarot message is for you. The first tarot message, and that is trust. To have trust. Trust your thoughts. Trust your instincts. Trust what the angels are revealing to you. Trust your intuition. That is the first message to you. And the second tarot message for you this month is, oh, this is a card of being prepared to walk away from something that's not working for you. This is regarding an emotional issue. So if something that you put a lot of energy into, a lot of hope into has not worked for you, you might be prepared to walk away from it. All right? And also, the third message from the tarot for you this month is, oh, adventures. To go ahead and have an adventure. You know, to go ahead and do something different. To shake things up. To get out of your comfort zone. To try something new. We got that new moon. We got the full moon. You know, we got things that you may want to do. So your message from the tarot this month is to trust your instincts, trust your intuition, trust, you know, what messages are coming to you from your angels, to be prepared to walk away from situations that are not working for you, no matter how hard you want them, if they're not working, you may be prepared to let them go, and to be prepared to have an adventure. Maybe you need to do something on your own or do something with a brand new group of friends or with a brand new person. But whatever it is, have something exciting happening in your life this month. So if you would like a personal reading for me to take a look at your chart and find out what is going on for you and your planets, contact me at KimAllen.com. That is KimAllen.com and I will schedule a reading for you and have a wonderful month. Thank you.